How's it going YouTube? For today's video I have the Toner TC777 and this is a USB condenser microphone. As always I'm going to quickly unbox it to show you how it comes in the box. Instruction manual, service card with a two year replacement warranty, pop filter. Oh it all comes out together. Let's pop it out. The microphone is on a shock absorber mount. You can see here we'll just screw this right on. The microphone is not hitting on any of the plastic as it is floating. We can see the toner logo right there. And we have a microphone filter. You can take it off and you reveal metal mesh guard. And of course, it does have a mount, strong legs. We have a strap. It seems to be a pretty long cable. I really do like the gooseneck. It's very flexible and it stays right where it needs to be. So the microphone outer casing is plastic i think honestly i'm really not sure it's convincing okay let's check on the bottom of it you can see that there is a tightening screw we also have another screw for the head to tilt it in the head the legs are metal hard plastic and we got some rubber grip really quiet i can't even hear me turning this so that's really nice it's not that tall it's pretty small you can see my arm but we're gonna plug this in now and i'm gonna do a screen record i will be testing it with the filter with the pop filter. Okay, I'm gonna press record here. Okay, so here's my audio interface right here. I'm using Sony Vegas. This is my video editor that I've been using for the last eight years. I went from 11 to 13. But anyways, they're like at 20, I think. <laughs> okay, so without doing any software, just plugged in the microphone and I do not see anything come up, but I will click on my sound settings. And you can see microphone toner. Oh, it's actually already automatically without having to do any configuration. So I'm going to be putting on my headphones. As you can see that it moves there. Let me move my camera around. All right, so this is my light source here. You're going to have to put up with my sweaty, grungy face. So I'm going to actually press record here. And we're going to see the audio levels. So if you can see that's actually pretty low. Um, let me get closer to the microphone. Lower, which I just lowered myself. Now I am like at four inches away. If I do put this filter right in front of it, I'm going to be able to go puh, puh. But why put that down? But why put that down? So now that I can see the audio levels, they're a lot higher. That's actually sounding way better. And then I can also see the audio levels right here. They go pretty low and that's nothing tweaked. So I... Don't even know what that's sounding like because I can't hear it. I don't have my headphones on to monitor myself, but we can play it back here. So I'm going to press stop. Okay, I'm going to listen back now. Record here. And we're going to see the audio levels getting closer. Now that I can see the audio levels, they're a lot higher. That's actually sounding way better. Okay, so I just listened back to it and it sounds okay, but it could obviously be better sound control panel now that we're in sound control panel okay now we are recording once again so let's go into recording and go into the one that is talking right there so we double click and we go to listen and i can listen to this device listen listen hello there i can hear myself but it's a little bit as an echo so i'm not gonna um levels okay microphone in advance cd quality dvd quality so you can change that uh, play with the settings, obviously, and if we go to levels, uh, you can go higher. Let's do 100%, see what that sounds like. Whoa, you can see the <laughs> way too high. So if I actually put this away from me, now I'm it's still pretty loud. You can see this is pretty far from how I'm talking. If I had it away from me, that's what it is. Oh, I'm sorry if it sounds really loud. Um, let me go back to nine, well, 90. So 90 lowers big time to there. I don't remember what it was on, actually. So let me go to 95 sounds like this. And that might be better. Um, of course, I am, again, the same distance. As you can see, it's just barely out of frame. Let me get it back closer. Um, you can see... This is not how you really want to uh, record your stuff. You want to be up and close. So when you're talking to it, it sounds like a radio quality. You don't have to yell. You can talk softer and talk like this. But most likely, we want to keep it at the 90 so that it's not going to clip and sound too bad. But it sounds like it's doing okay. I can just okay that. And that's what just coming from the computer settings. Of course, you can go into your software and tweak it more from there now i'm going to remove this here 
talk into it without the pop filter so we can see how that is from this position. I'm not talking too loud. I'm talking at a comfortable inside voice and it's still pretty loud. So I might have to go back and change some of the volume microphone levels. Let's drop that down to 86. That's my ear. I am going to talk around. So this is behind it. It does seem that behind it, it is not the same. As you can see, it looks a lot lower. Now talking on to the side, this is the side. And then the other side, oh, I keep hitting stuff on my face. And then back to the middle. And if we talk on to the top portion, so you can see what that will sound like. And then right back to the middle. Put in this filter. So if you don't want to use this, you can use this foam filter and it'll still kind of do the same thing. And you know, you're not going to hit your mouth, but actually I got to talk a little bit lower and I'll have to listen back to that so I can see what that sounds like. But this can be your audio just right out of the box, plug and play, no need to download any software. And obviously for your gaming sessions, for your podcast, for your voiceovers, or for your video making on YouTube, Twitch, whatever it's going to be. And that's pretty much all I really have to do, just give you that sample. Another thing, in case you want to use your own tripod, you can unscrew this. Woo! Heavy. And you can plug it into your own okay so obviously if you heard that hopefully wasn't too rattly and whatever i am still sweating you can see my face glistening more but um this is still pretty cool fun to play with again if you want it for yourself you already know what to do find it in the description down below and as always thank you for watching and i will see you guys next time later